The North Carolina GOP making clear they condemn Senator Richard Burr's vote to find former President Donald Trump guilty of inciting the January 6th riot on the Capitol. After a unanimous vote to censure Burr, the GOP releasing a statement saying they, quote, agree with the strong majority of Republicans in both the U.S. House of Representatives and Senate that the Democrat-led attempt to impeach a former president lies outside the United States Constitution. At the beginning of the trial, Burr voted it was unconstitutional to impeach a president no longer in office. When the Senate voted to proceed, Burr said his role was to be an impartial juror. He released this statement on Saturday saying the evidence is compelling that President Trump is guilty of inciting an insurrection against a co-equal branch of government and that the charge rises to the level of high crimes and misdemeanors. Therefore, I have voted to convict. UNCG political science expert Tom Little says the vote by the NCGOP to formally express their disapproval does nothing but make a statement. It means nothing. It makes them feel good. It makes them think they've done something. It would make Trump it may make Trump supporters happy, but it achieves absolutely nothing. In response to the NCGOP's move to censure, Senator Burr called it a sad day for North Carolina Republicans, going on to say, my party's leadership has chosen loyalty to one man over the core principles of the Republican Party, and the founders of our great nation. It's important to note Burr announced years ago that he's not running for re-election. His term ends next year. Marissa Tancino, WFMY News 2.